Come on, let me in. Yes. Oh, you're done, bro. You're done, mate. Oh, yes, you're done, you're done, you're done. Oh, he's gonna... <laughs> Check this out! Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Matt and welcome back to a brand new series on my channel. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to a series that you guys have asked for, but some of you guys have also not wanted. So, I thought I'd give this series a little bit of a try. I'll get into what it is in a second so you guys are aware. Uh, but some of you guys wanted this, some of you guys didn't want this, so I just went with a bold choice and decided to go with it. If you guys want me to keep uploading these videos, please let me know, that would be awesome. If you don't want me to upload these videos, or if you want me to try something else, please also comment that down uh, below. Uh, a quick little update also, the dislikes have, are probably going to go down, because uh, I did actually manage to talk to Dynamite Flying Jono, and we are pretty cool now, so... Uh, hopefully the dislikes shouldn't be pretty high unless there are actual haters who don't like my videos, which I mean I'm not too bothered about because if they don't like my videos they can go ahead and dislike because that's their opinion really, but um, Yeah, so you may be wondering what is this and we are on Viper HCF the IP to the server will be in the description if you want to come and join me uh, So I'm just gonna give you guys a basic tour of this entire base because there's not really much that I need to show you guys um, we're pretty much a power faction. You can see we've got a beacon. We've managed to get a wither. We've almost got an end portal complete, which is pretty good. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm going to type slash F who so that you guys know who are actually in my faction. Now we've got me, which is myself. We've got Warmenius MC, which you may know from my age. All these people are pretty much from my age, apart from Gaggle. Uh, I don't know if he actually played. I've only spoke to him like three times. He's a pretty chill dude. Um... But as I said, there's really nothing else that I need to show you guys other than the valuables and stuff. Now, currently we don't have any iron or diamond blocks. Uh, the chests are a bit unorganized, so I apologize for that. Um, another quick little update. Uh, in my last Minecraft video, you may have noticed that my FOV uh, was in fact on 90 like that. Uh, but I did change it because I feel like I can PvP a lot better when it's down to 75. Uh, so I'm going to keep my P my PvP uh, a little bit more simpler by keeping my FOV like this. So if you guys like it, let me know. I also turned on bobbing so that you can see like my vision's bobbing again. Some of you guys wanted that. Uh, I actually quite like it now that I've got used to it again. So uh, just let me know if you guys want anything to change in these videos. That would be awesome. Uh, and let's just get right into the base tour. Alright, so kicking it off, we have our nether portal. Not really much to show from this, other than you can go to the nether in it. It's a pretty cool design. Uh, you can see we've got a sky base. I'll go down there in a second, but I'll show you guys the main the main base for now. So we got that. We got the auto smelters right there. Uh, these are our subclaims. I'm not actually sure why we've got subclaims, but we, we have. Uh, I think it's just so that people can't argue about taking other stuff. And you can see that someone's actually been taking stuff from Matthias' chest, so... That does kind of suck. Um, but yeah, my vault hasn't really got that much interesting stuff in it. It's got fortune pickaxes, cobwebs, paper. It's really not that interesting. We have got a god bow, actually, which would be pretty cool to use out in PvP later on. Uh, we got a good amount of pearls. Uh, I'm not sure about gunpowder. Yeah, we got a good amount of gunpowder, but we've also got gunpowder in Algebra's chest, who is the owner of the faction. Uh, shit ton of glowstone. That's pretty much all you guys need to see from the valuables. We've only got, like, farming materials and stuff there. Someone did take the items out of the item frames, which does suck. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much all I need to show you guys for those chests. Over here, we've just got potions that have been brewed. I don't know how much we've got. I think it was just those. Yeah, we've still got a good amount of potions, actually. we got a shit ton of speed, uh, too, which is pretty cool. A shit ton of speed. Um, I don't think we have any fire resistance or invisibility potions at the moment. We have magma creams, as you can see there. Um, so, when the faction come on, I'm probably going to do a little bit of a run, maybe to the end, or... Uh, God knows, hopefully we can get some good PvP action. But I'll quickly show you guys the traps, uh, because I know some of you guys might actually be wanting to see this. Now, I'm going to start over here because we have a little bit of a trap over here. Uh, if you guys want this waypoints mod, it's literally just raise minimap. You just type M, waypoints, blah, blah, blah. Uh, so it's pretty cool. Uh, this is the trap we got in here. And then you just have to literally click this button and then it just drops you down. You have to press this one to close it, however. So 
It's not really that good because you have to press two buttons, which is a disadvantage. But when they get stuck down here, it's pretty much just a bow until they die from here. So that's pretty awesome. Uh, that's all I really need to show you guys for the base. I'm just going to run over here while I'm talking. Uh, that's pretty much all we have for the base. Nothing much really to show. So if you guys do uh, want like a bigger tour of the base, let me know in the comments. Uh, I'll probably put a timestamp so you guys can skip through the base tour if you don't actually want to do it, because I feel like it's not really been that interesting. Uh, this used to be a gift place, which is... Don't worry about it, basically. Uh, down here was a fall trap. I nearly, I nearly pressed that. Uh, here we go. Yeah, I fell down my own fall trap, as you can see, with a death point. So if someone falls down here, all their stuff will get put in each chest, which is pretty awesome. So, Guys, I'm going to stop annoying you guys. I'm going to go head into some PvP or something like that. I don't know really what else to do this video. So if you do enjoy, please leave a like. That would be much appreciated. And I will see you guys in a minute. Goodbye. Okay, guys. So right now, we're heading over to End Exit, where I'm pretty sure there will be a guaranteed amount of PvP over here. Uh, if you guys want to PvP me for a video or something, you guys can always feel free to come to my base. Uh, you can just type slash F who smoked and then you can get the coordinates for it if you want to come over and PvP me. Uh, so hopefully we don't run into anyone. I'd like to go to end uh, that way, end exit, that way I can try and kill someone. If there is like a six man faction there, I will probably kite it back to base and see what we can do. So there are a lot of fall traps around here. So if you are running towards my base or away from my base, you've got to be careful. Uh, my friend Yai, uh, who also plays Minage PvP, has also fell in these traps. Which really does suck. So have I. So I'm, I'm not the odd man out. Uh, but we're just making our way over here right now. We should be there in a moment. We're going to see if we can get a quick... A, a quick? We're going to see if we can get a nice little quick drop. Because I haven't really killed many people. I'm going to type slash stats so you guys can see quickly. I've killed 7 people and died 13 times. Which really does suck. So hopefully we can turn that around this video. I doubt we will because it is very hard to kill people. Uh, but as you can see, full P2, sharp 2, and breaking 3 sword. We got the parts. We got the instant healing parts. Let's see what we can do. We're coming up on exit right now. There's a guy slash F who jette. Uh, Alright, he's a one-man faction. So we're going to go over there and PvP him. Let's see what we can do, actually. Because that would be pretty awesome if we could do a lot of damage to him. So he is actually getting wrecked right now. Oh, he's in a little bit of a gank there. Oh, he's pulling away. I don't know if I want to follow that pearl. Could be a little bit of a trap. What was his faction again? It was... Did I lose it? Oh, I couldn't see. Damn it. Someone's bowing at me from a distance, actually, which really does suck. Slash F who... Jeff. I can't type. Jeff A. So flex. So we need to be careful if we run into flex territory. Uh, so I'm just going to keep looking at my chat for a moment, making sure that I don't run into flex territory. Um, I've actually been to this base before. I can't say I trust it, because uh, there's so much long grass by it. Oh my god, I messed up there. Alright, this guy is pretty trash, to be honest. So let's see if we can get a quick little drop on him. Yeah, he's he's kind of bad. He's kind of bad. He's kind of getting wrecked right now. Let's see what we can do. Come on, come on. Oh, he's pulling away like a little pussy. Alright, I'm going to try and avoid pearling to him unless I see some flat land. Oh my god, so this guy is actually just like kiting it back to his base for his life. He does not want to die whatsoever. I've forgotten his faction name as well, which really I'm going to have to F him again, I think. Um, I think it was Flex slash F who Jatte. Yeah, it was Flex. I was right the entire time. There he is. I want to pearl on him, but I... Mm, yeah, I don't think I'm going to pearl on him just yet because I don't trust this territory at the moment. Um, but we've been kiting this guy for a little bit of a while now. He's not really... I think his base is a little bit of a distance away, uh, which... Yeah, I, I think... Oh, there he is. I was going to give up there, but I don't think that would have been the best idea just now. So he's definitely baiting me. He wants me to follow him. Um, so we'll just wait for him to pearl, and I think we'll probably follow it this time. You missed that bow shot, buddy. You missed that bow shot. How are you gonna How are you gonna come back from that, eh? I don't think you can, buddy boy. Don't think you can. Wow, that's an OG name. Looking chat, HC squads. Quite an OG name, in fact. In fact, there we go. So we're gonna be keeping our eye out for flex. Uh, this is getting a bit sketchy because of how dark it is right now. He's not actually pearled, but I think he just did there. Um, 
Hopefully he disappears so we can pearl after him. For all we know, this could be a pearl. Oh, I think this is his base that he's coming up on now. Yeah, this is his base. This is 100% his base. Uh, let's see if he can fall for the bait. I think I'm going to pre pearl up here. Let's run in there, see what we can do. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> All right, guys, so that was a little bit boring. So I'm going to actually see if I can find another fight with someone who doesn't kite to their base every time. So I'll be back in a second with another clip. And yeah, guys, see you in a second. All right, guys, so it looks like Jate has actually agreed to fight. I wasn't ready, man. That's a bit scummy there. All right, but we're going to see if we can fight him. Uh, as I said, I haven't warmed up, so my aim may be a little bit uh, messed up. So I think this guy's toggling. I don't really want to jump to conclusions. But he's actually kind of wrecking us right now. I did say he was easy, but he might have just been kiting it when we were fighting him. Uh, let's just get a quick refill here. Where did he go? Oh, my God. Okay, that reach is pretty, pretty good for him. Uh, let's just see what we can do, because I know this guy isn't, like, the best person in the world uh, but as you can see oh he's definitely fishy he's definitely fishy uh, but i don't know what to say about it really he's got a fishing rod which is also quite annoying uh, let's see what we can do here yeah he's he's getting some mad combos on us right now uh, but he's at least he's fighting that's all i'm happy about uh we just need to really conserve on pots and we should be good uh, but as you can see, he's getting a lot of... Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. I just missed two pots there. That was really bad. I don't know what this pot preservation is right now that we're even trying. But he's definitely wrecking us. And that fishing rod is so annoying, dude. Oh, my God. No. <laughs> Holy crap. That would have been really bad there. Uh, where's he gone? Okay, there he is. Uh, just do that. I don't know if we need... The fuck? Did I just... Why did I just take damage? Oh, he's lagging, I think. The fuck? I think, I think I'm lagging. Oh, everyone's lagging. Oh, God. Oh, God, no. Okay, guys, so it looks like the lag has been fixed. We're going to repot right now. Uh, this guy isn't actually that scummy because he let me pot a speed right there. But his fishing rod is kind of annoying. He, oh, my God. We nearly fell in a trap right there, which would have been really bad on our part. But he's definitely... Oh, my God. <laughs> we nearly got quickied there. Jesus Christ. Oh, yeah. He's, he's definitely fishy. I have to say that for sure. I, I, I can't compete with this guy. He's definitely dropped me, I think. Oh my god. That doesn't help. My pot filter just fell too. I think we might have to actually kite it from this because he's kind of destroying us right now. Especially with his fishing rod. It's kind of annoying to fight him with. Um, let's see if we can even do any... Yeah, he's he's definitely... Yeah, he's definitely fishy. I don't think we can kite this either. But he's definitely fishy. What the fuck? Yeah, I, I don't know if I can fight this, guys. I might need to run because this is going... Yeah, I'm going to run from this guy because he is kind of annoying. Uh, he's got me on a fishing rod, too. Let's just pearl away here. Uh, I don't really want to fight him like this because, you know, he's a... Uh, fuck, he's a good chaser. He's really good at chasing. He's really good at chasing. This is bad. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. I'm definitely not going to carry it to base here, but I will try my absolute best. Uh, I don't really think there's much I can do in this situation, but he keeps tagging me as well. Uh, I'm on my last pot. I'll try and pull this away. Uh, he's definitely doing a lot of damage to me, so that does suck. So I'm not allowed to go there, so I think that's actually a safe spot, which is pretty cool. Uh, let's see if we can run over there, because that would be nice. Um, so he's definitely trying to do this right now. Uh, I'm just going to run for my absolute best. Uh, keep using third person to my advantage. Pearl over there. Uh, you may be wondering why I'm running. I, I'm just running because I think this guy is fishy as hell. Uh, I don't really think he's legit, to be completely honest with you guys. Uh, but I think he's definitely going to catch us at this point. Uh, there we go. Let's get a quick pearl in over there. Oh, he just pearled in front of me. That was bad. That was really, really bad. So, spawn is only 500 blocks away, but my base is, in fact, 700 away. So, oh my god. He, if he keeps tagging me like this, I'm going to be done for. If he tags me one more time, I'm literally done for. So, let's just get another pearl in there. This is going to be one hell of a kite, guys, if we can make this. I really hope we can. Let's just stay out of his bow range for a little while. And we should be good. So let's see if he can miss these bow shots. Because that would be pretty cool if he could. 
So we're going to pearl again. We're going to see if we can literally take a really big advantage right here. So it looks like he's fell behind a little bit. I'm just going to continue to kite to base. I have no more speeds left as well, which is a big issue. Um, but he's not behind me, so I'm just going to pearl as fast as I can. All right, guys. So we made it to base pretty safely right now. So we nearly got dropped, unfortunately. But let me know what you guys think. I don't know if that guy was hacking or not. Uh, it's hard to tell when you're in like the heat of the moment or something. But that guy did seem fishy as hell. He had some insane reach, so... Let me know if it was okay for me to run from that 1v1 because I did tell him not to run myself before we started fighting. But considering it looked like he was toggling because, you know, at end exit in the previous clip, you saw that I was actually doing a lot of damage to him and he couldn't actually defend himself. So let me know what you guys think. I don't know if that guy was hacking. Hopefully he wasn't. But uh, sorry, hopefully he was. That way I won't feel bad for running. But I'm glad we made it back. I'm glad we survived because that would have would have been real. Sorry, I can't speak. That would have been really bad if we did die. But that's it for today's video, guys. So if you did enjoy it, please leave a like. That would be much appreciated. If you didn't, dislike it. Tell me why in the comments down below. Thank you so much for watching, and I will catch you guys later.